What is up, Keeper Nation? This is FA Goalkeeping here, bringing you a full-on field review of the Adidas Predator Pro Telstar gloves in the stunning red, white, and black pixelated colorway. Adidas is one of the biggest companies to buy goalkeeper gloves from as they have world-class keepers like Ter Stegen, Manuel Neuer, Kaylor Navas, and many other known goalkeepers. But you might be asking yourself, for the price of 130 US dollars, are they really worth it? Well, I'm here to tell you all about them, so let's get into them. The Predator Pro Telstar gloves features a negative cut on a very lightweight prime knit material that gives it a tighter and more snug feel. I got these gloves in a size 9 and I can say that they are very true to size. These are one of the most comfortable fitting gloves I have played in and the best fitting gloves of the Adidas goalkeeper line. The palm of the gloves consists of an Evo Zone Tech that includes two types of foams for grip and shock absorption. For the first few weeks of playing in these gloves, the grip was amazing and I felt very comfortable making saves. After washing the gloves for the first time, I noticed that the gloves began to lose a bit of their grip. I did also notice that when playing on turf fields, the foam on the gloves tore off very easily on the palm and fingertip areas. The Predator Pro Telstar gloves start out with fantastic grip, but only after two weeks of intense training and match play, the grip goes from great to decent, which hurts for the pricing and for being a professional performance glove. Moving on to the backhand, the glove includes a silicone material that is very helpful when punching balls out as you do not feel as much sting as other goalkeeper gloves. My favorite feature of the gloves is a double wrist strap that Adidas is so famous for. The double wrist strap is a very important feature because it prevents your hands from sliding and moving within the gloves while keeping the ball out of the net. This is about 2 months into the gloves and apart from the small tears on the palms and fingertips and the loss of grip, the gloves held up quite well. Make sure to subscribe and leave a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching my video. Please leave down in the comments which gloves you guys would like to see me review next. Until next time keepers.